welcome back to my channel and thank you for tuning in so today's video is all about how to apply foundation um, I think you yeah, are for beginners how to apply a foundation to look flawless then please keep on watching and let's get in with the video the most I think this is even the most important part of this whole tutorial is the primer the primer is so important because the primer prepares your face for the foundation so that it can look flawless um i've been actually enjoying this one from essence lately um the prime plus studio glow boosting pore minimizing primer it has a pink clay in that so and then this primer and it also gives your face like a nice glowy effect so i'm just gonna take like that amount and rub that all over my face okay so now we're gonna go in to foundation and the foundation that I'm going to use is the Revlon Photo Ready Airbrush Effect and the shade is Natural Beige. I like to go in with my finger and I'm just going to dab like a few dots over here with the foundation. And the trick with foundation is to go in in small layers so you don't want to like take four or five pumps of foundation and put everything on your face you need to go in with the first layer and then let it dry go in with the second layer let it dry till you find your perfect coverage I'm gonna go in with my beauty blender the damp one and blend this up can see this foundation is almost my my shade so now that the foundation is the first layer is on my face I'm gonna wait till this dries and with the second layer I like to apply um, the second layer just on the outer parts of my face but then I'm not gonna use but then I'm going to use like the lightest hand with the foundation with the foundation beauty blender. I'm going to use my lightest hand. I'm not going to press really hard because if you press really hard, you are going to let all the products soak into the beauty blender. So I'm going to go. So I think, yeah, this, I think this is fine. We can go in with our second layer and I'm just going to do like the exact same technique that I just so you want to blend the foundation down your neck so that it doesn't look like you're wearing a mask that's really important so that's what I'm doing so now uh, the tips for foundation that's really important I think that um, as you can see you need to find a foundation that's really that's gonna work for your skin that's your obviously your skin tone um, if you're looking there's different types of foundation on the market so if you are looking for a more glowy type of foundation you will find that if you are looking for a more matte foundation you'll definitely find that so that is for the foundation for the liquid foundation i think i actually i like this i know that this next step is actually part of the highlighting and contouring but i know that 
there's a lot of people that don't do highlighting contouring so that's why i just want to implement this step also in here and this is the concealer and apply the concealer under my eyes so and the concealer is a little bit lighter than um the rest of my face that is just to highlight under our eyes make our eyes look more awake so that's what i'm going to do and then i'm gonna take the sponge again and just gonna blend it out like i did with the foundation i don't want to press too hard with the sponge Can you see like that versus that? There's like a huge difference. Taking the, the other side of my sponge and just like blending everything out. So now that all the liquids are in place, normally I would have like gone in with a cream contour and every in highlight and everything like that. But because the video is not about that, if you want a more a detailed how to highlight in contour, you can check out my video. I'm gonna leave the link somewhere in here so you can check out that video but for the video this is all about how to apply foundation and concealer for beginners so yeah that's that so now we we have all the liquids in place i'm just gonna go in with the powder to set under my eyes and for the powder i'm using the yardley uh, absolute translucent loose powder and this powder is for all skin tones um really amazing i like this and for this powder i like to go in with a dry sponge i'm just gonna take the beauty blender that i just used and make sure there's like no creases under my eyes okay so we just have load setting i hope that the lighting is quite okay i know it's not the best now but anyway, um, I'm just going to finish. So, if, um, what was I busy doing? So, I was actually busy setting the eyes with the dry um, sponge. And I actually did that. I don't want to apply too much of the powder. That's all that I'm going to do for now. And then, I'm going to finish off the rest of my face. And then, I'll be back to show you the final look but that's that for now is for the foundation how to apply foundation so i'll be back to show you like the final look um when i'm done with the rest of my face so see you now now okay so that is um, the way of apply foundation. Where the video actually cut it off is um, the setting under the eye. So I just actually used um, this sponge and I just like dabbed the um, powder there, just like so with the powder. And then um, I just set my whole face using a brush. Um, and I use the fit me fit me press powder so for further because the video is not about highlighting and contouring if you want a video on highlighting and contouring I'll leave it here thank you for watching and I hope you enjoy the video please make sure to give this video a like if you enjoy the video and please subscribe to my channel and be a part of my YouTube family. And till I see you in the next one.